at the seal, look at the sizzle. <laughs> Nothing holds heat like cast iron. That's why grandma loved it. That old black <laughs> cast iron skillet. That old beautiful oven. She loved it, but it was a pain in the neck. You had to season it. You had to clean it. You had to dry it. If you didn't dry it, it was going to rust. Folks, everybody knows that cast iron is the touchstone, the generational cookware that is regarded as the best of the best of the best. Normally, you have to spend three, four, five hundred dollars on cast iron, and still it's not nonstick, and still you can't put it in the dishwasher. We are going to show you there is a better way, a new way, a truly game-changing way that comes in glorious colors from red to teal to this stunning rose. We have taupe and also plum and black. This is your two-piece set. Guys, this is a, um, well, as you can see, the casserole pan. This is a beautiful four quart helper handles. Nothing is riveted on. It's all one piece, so nothing to come loose. Guys, this is every stovetop, even induction. This is oven safe up to 500 degrees. That is a second pan that we're using to grill and see those steaks that also turns into lid. We're going to make breads in this. We're going to do everything. And we're all going to do it with a little help from our famous friend, television's very own Mr. Mark Gill, who truly is an expert in the kitchen. Good to see you, sir. How are you, my man? Mark, I was watching in January when okay. you launched this new line. Mark, there's never been anything like this. No, you know what? There really hasn't. And we're going to start talking about this nonstick right off the bat here. I'm just going to get this going. Uh, just kind of let it sit in there for a second. We'll get that back to that in a minute. Okay. Now, listen, I am. I, what a treat to cook for you tonight on this stuff. <laughs> I got to you, tell sir. you, so you're right. We launched this in January, and we got to come out on live television and say this is nonstick, dishwasher safe, cast iron, and the country almost lost it. They thought I you mean, were crazy. All you got to do is read the reviews, you guys, and have a look. So, listen, this is two pans in one. This okay. is your four-quart deep, deep, deep dish casserole pan with your grill lid lid. Okay. I mean, it's hard. <laughs> a lot going on there, right? <laughs> Basically, you've got your grill pan and you've got your casserole dish. When you put them together, you're braising, you're slow cooking. You're actually, if I can show you this here while yeah. everything's happening, you're actually cooking on top of the oven. Talk about great for small spaces. Oh. And the fact that this is all cast iron and not, not like the cast iron that gets you through. Yeah. Not like the cast iron that's trying to be something. Right. This is real cast iron, non-stick, dishwasher safe. All you have to do guys is read the reviews now have a look here we're talking non-stick and we're talking the real deal this is parmesan cheese melting in a pan if you tried to do this to your mom's cast iron pan or your grandma's the wooden spoon would come right out because <laughs> in order for those pans to work they have to be seasoned and re-seasoned and re-seasoned yeah. and that's the whole point that's the only way they stay non-stick it's the only way they work our pans don't come pre-seasoned because they don't need to be pre-seasoned. Right. And everything that you're going to see me do here today is an enemy of cast iron. Milks, sugars, milk solids, wines, acids. We're going to deglaze pans. We're going to bake in the oven. We're going to braise. We're going to fry. We're going to do everything that this pan makes possible for us. And i got to tell you something. When it comes time to clean, yep. you see what we're doing here with the cheese and I the cream? I see what you're doing. This isn't scrubbing. This isn't soaking. All this is when we're done is just giving it a wipe. Wait till you see the cleanups that we've got today. So watch this. I'm just going to take the cheese right out. <laughs> and this is life, folks. We're, we're, we're not scared to show you anything. I mean, this is, this is what you would not see on traditional cast iron. Exactly. Think about how many wonderful soups and stews and chilies you're going to be able to do in that four-quart casserole pan exactly as well. Right. This is something you'll pass down to your daughter, to your kids. There'll probably be a fight over it as well. Oh, thank you, my love. <laughs> well, I can promise you nobody is fighting over your copper pans. This is true. Nobody is fighting over your regular non-stick. And I'm going to tell you why while this cheese melts inside for our mac and cheese. How about yeah. these steaks, okay? Okay. When I flip these over on the cutting board, you're gonna see what we all lost. Have a look at this. When you see these uh, advertisements for steaks in these fancy steak houses, yeah. they're not saying to anybody, hey, we're gonna cook your steak on, uh, on stainless, we're gonna cook your steak on copper. Right. We're gonna cook your steak on heavy cast iron cookware. Sure. Because- The good stuff. The good stuff, because the problem is, with cast iron, by the time you get those great results, you can't clean it. Well, when it comes time to clean, have a look at this, you guys, it's simply wipes away like it wasn't there. Is that That's crazy? cast iron. Can you believe that? Well, Absolutely incredible. Well, folks, I'm going to quickly do this. Let, For let's sure. go over the colors real fast. I'm going to yep. head back here. Every home in America should have this. Every <laughs> home in America should have one of these amazing cast iron casserole pans. I'm, I'm going to give you the updates on four colors that are limited. 
taupe. So this is gonna be your taupe over here. Plum and also rose. So taupe, plum, I love that. Isn't that gorgeous? I wanna show you the rose. I'm gonna grab the rose a second and I'm gonna, gosh, guys, this is, this is, <laughs> this is real cast iron, real cast iron. There's the taupe versus the rose. Can you see that clearly now? Okay, so this is the rose on top. Taupe is that softer color below it. Okay, so rose and taupe. We also have here, as you'll see, a beautiful black, a really nice blue. That's a beautiful blue. Then we've got our teal and that gorgeous designer red. You and I go to the mall, we go to that culinary superstore, that gourmet store, and you know that absolutely you would spend a fortune on cast iron. So. That was the lid that we had out as an example. This, <laughs> this, and I exaggerated there a little to demonstrate, folks, that this is the real deal. We're gonna ship this for $5.50. Do you know what the biggest concern was from folks who were uh, in meetings about this launch? People were worried that the price was so low that you wouldn't think it was real cast iron. It's real cast iron, but non-stick and this is oven safe, and this is dishwasher safe. Two pounds for the price of one, and obviously with the amazing FlexPay as well, it's easy to get it home and to try it out. You'll use it. I wanna let you know if you're using the HSN credit card, you've got an extra FlexPay. We're gonna field some questions. Mark, if questions come through. Absolutely. I'll, I'll quick fire one right now. Okay. Okay, great questions. Karen wants to know, can you mash potatoes in the pan? Absolutely, you can mash potatoes in the pan. Absolutely, absolutely. Next question, George wants to know if you add Pam nonstick spray on it. Um, you, we don't hear. You can, and that actually is a, is, is a building block to an, an even better question, which is oils and butters. Right. All right? Listen, if you want to use oils and butters, if you're still on that, uh, re, uh, you know, New Year's resolution train, remember those? They were fun. <laughs> From uh, January, then listen, don't worry about the butters and oils. But if you like the taste of butter and oil, then by all means, go ahead and add it. But it's nothing you have to do to get the results like you're seeing right here. This is your five-star restaurant quality cast iron seared steak. And I'm just gonna pause for a second. Look at this. Guys, if you're a steak lover, oh. there is your crust. There's your beautiful inside, right there. That's the kind of results you get from cast iron and cast iron only. I gotta try some of that. Love it, please do. Guys, there's a lot of features to this and it really does take a minute to sink in because ultimately, Mark, mm -hmm. you're saying things that have never been said in the history of cast exactly. iron, Exactly, right? and then remember, this is not uh, just a coating that's gonna scratch off. We have molecularly bonded the nonstick properties to the cast iron. So listen, we recommend you use silicone and wooden handle, you, that kind of thing, but if you want to, if your need is the metal ones, guys, you are not going to affect the performance of this pan. These are oven safe uh, to 500 degrees. That means right. they're grill safe to 500 degrees. And even some of the dishes that you would never dream of in cast iron, like mac and cheese, uh -huh. are absolutely the ones that are going to end up being your favorite. Because now you can take all those rules that we've always had with cast iron and just kind of toss them out the window. They don't really apply anymore because you've got cookware that performs like the cookware that we've been using for thousands of years, right? But you've got it now with all of those great properties of being able just to wipe it out. And Adam, here's the problem. Yeah. Back in the, uh, you know, you and I haven't gotten a chance to talk about the nonstick cast iron. Back in no. the early 80s is when all of that kind of nonstick cookware started showing up. Right. We started seeing it everywhere. And listen, it's beautiful. It's easy to clean. It's fast. But here's the problem. It's kind of like that kid's toy that you make a picture out of, and then you turn around and it disappears, yes. right? <laughs> There's no character in what you're cooking on. Right. That's why, like I said, those five-star res uh, restaurants don't add advertise that, right. that, they're, that they're cooking on it. What they sure. advertise is that they're cooking on this because cool. what happens is you've got that deep, heavy pan that's gonna pick up and hold on to those flavors. It's gonna remember your family's signature as you're cooking at it year over year. Now, follow me back to the oven here because remember, it's not just the grill pan we're talking about here. And if all we were talking about was the grill pan and we ended it there and showed you our demos, if you've ever shopped for that fancy high-end French cast iron, I know the one. you know what kind of deal that is. The fact that it tops a four-quart deep-sided casserole dish at the same time is absolutely out of this 
world. So I'm gonna go ahead, put our mac and cheese in there, and I'm gonna cook you another treat. Come on over here, this is kind of fun. I'm you ever heard of a this. Dutch baby? Yes, okay. you mentioned this before. So, <laughs> Tell so, me. So here's what a Dutch baby is. A Dutch baby is a German baked pancake. Okay. All right, and this is one of these dishes that people will go out and specifically buy pieces of equipment like this for, and here's why. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put this in the oven, all right? Okay. Now, our side walls we've preheated, so as this bakes, this is gonna carry up those sidewalls. And what happens in a pan where they change the construction or it's a different type of heat up the side, yeah. you don't get the puffiness, you don't get the life, you don't get the character, you don't get exactly what the dish is supposed to be. You get some sort of tofu version. Mm -hmm. All of this is based around having that heavy, real deal pan and now you've got it without that heavy real deal french price you know what i mean <laughs> uh, do you think about what you can do with this and how often you'll use this because you get the casserole pan and you get the grill pan you'll be making breakfast lunch and dinner your steak your beautiful well i can't wait to see the dutch baby that we're doing <laughs> but really everything that you want to do for those get togethers the family events this is something that's going to be used you do not need to worry a lot of the questions that are coming through are you you know, is this gonna damage if I use this, if I use that? Folks, it's a world first, truly non-stick. Nothing that's gonna come loose, nothing that's gonna come off. The helper handles are not riveted on. Right. It's all one it's right piece. There. That single body construction is extraordinary. But this, when you finish, nobody's gonna be shying away from cleanup <laughs> because you just put it in the dishwasher. And the cleanup is what it is. Listen, there's so many times, you guys, oh, geez, uh, if you've ever heard of something called seasoning, yes. every time you buy a cast iron pan, you have to season it. Right. It's the act of taking oil and using it to fill the little mountains and valleys that are all inside of your cast iron pan. Now right. listen, when cast iron's made, uh, they use a sand mold, they pour the iron in, they wait for it to cool, and then they smash the mold. Okay. And what that does is it gives you a pan as individual as you are, just like a snowflake or a fingerprint, there are no two alike, and that's what it's all about. So the fact that you're able to do even like regular dishes like you're seeing here that you would normally do on like a little pan sure. and just kind of make it kind of, yeah, it's okay, yeah. right? Now you're gonna take these dishes and you're gonna add a life and a dimension to them that you've never seen. So guys, I've got my nachos here, family size. I mean, oh, you're gonna feed boy. an army with this. This is layers of cheese on the bottom. If you've worked with cast iron, that's a horrible idea. <laughs> okay? Cheese on the bottom, the layers of chicken, cheese, nachos all the way up. And have a look here. Earlier on the grill pan lid, we went and we charred off our peppers and used that to make the salsa that we're gonna use on this. So let me go ahead and then I'm gonna tend to my you got that for me? And that's incidentally <laughs> silver. You've got the beautiful silver color there. there we, we are busy. Guys, if you want, I'm gonna show you the tub because the tub's about to sell out. Come with me, everybody. We had a feeling this would happen because this is so revolutionary, it's so different. I know many of you are asking if the pan is heavy and we're gonna address that. It's important to know, let me just grab this one for a second. No, this is not light. No, <laughs> it is not light. It's real cast iron. This isn't cast iron like or cast iron type or faux cast iron, it's real cast iron. So you know, when I'm so talking about how it feels, the reason it's working so well is because it's genuine, genuine, genuine. The price is so low that most folks would think that it is not real, it is real. Okay, rose and taupe, fewer now than 600 in each option. So rose is the top one there. It's a beautiful blush color. I know Amy Morrison has that color in her uh, uh, kitchen. She bought the fry pans in that. Oh, by the way, we have fry pans coming up tonight. That's the taupe, which is a beautiful neutral as well. Plum, taupe, and rose on the verge, of course, of sellout tonight. Silver, I'm okay, but it's a hot color. This is gonna be the easy, beautiful designer red. This is gonna be your teal, the blue, and of course, the black is over there as well. I'd love to invite you to shop for the Southern Cast Iron Cookbook. We've had a lot of great feedback about this. Over 180 pages, full color images, and some great inspiration in terms of really getting to use your cast iron with you know, best results. Everything that you want to do from those fabulous sweet treats, right, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, it's all catered for in here. Ask about it, it is on FlexPay as well. Everything we're gonna to do tonight is Kitchen HQ. 
It's that proprietary line. It's something you cannot find anywhere else. So get excited. How do we address that, uh, Mark, with regards weight of the cast iron pads? Well, let's wander over there and have a look here, okay? okay. Uh, we actually brought a scale out to answer oh, that good. exact question because we do get a lot of people going, is it real cast iron? Is it right. part this, part that? Is there a coating? Is it enamel this? Let me tell you something, you guys. Watch this. Check out our scale here. This is the real deal. So if you've, it lapped it. All right. <laughs> this is one of those pans that I gotta tell you something. If you've ever, first of all, not used cast iron, maybe because you're the age that it was just never part of your life, or you stopped using it because of the cleanup, this is your chance to get back into it. And I gotta yeah. tell you something. I, I made the joke before. Yeah. Nobody's gonna fight you for your copper pan. Sure. We have one heirloom in our home and one only, and it's a cast iron pan from Scotland over 200 years old. Oh, and that's wow. what's in our family. And there are more meals that have been cooked on that pan throughout generations and generations of my family that when I cook on it, there's just something special about it. But I gotta tell you something, when we invited all that nonstick cookware into our lives, the 10 and the $15 throwaway pans, yeah. that's what we lost from Sunday meals. That's yeah. what we lost when we sit down for that date night with our spouse, that special occasion. Yeah. We lost all of that. But you get it back with Kitchen HQ's uh, cast iron. Have a look at this. And this is what I'm talking about. We're doing some pork medallions here. And what's cool about these, have a look at the grill marks. Have a look at them in the center. Have a look at them on the outside. Yeah. Guys, they're the same. And that's the beauty of cast iron. Everything cooks evenly. And when you're doing certain dishes like stews and breads and, and, and some of the stuff you're going to see tonight, that even cooking, I mean, that's everything. Yeah. Without the even cooking, you got nothing. Exactly. <laughs> you, got, you need your even cooking. No hot spots. Exactly. No hot spots exactly here. right. Uh, Mark, a lot of people were saying, you know, I mean, when they go from the older style cast iron and they upgraded to like an enamel cast iron, <laughs> you know, what was the issues with the enamel cast iron? Okay. So enamel is great. Don't get me wrong. You can make some beautiful food with enamel cast iron but you better learn the term release point if you don't want to learn that term then skip over it <laughs> it's one of those uh, cooking skills that come with time come with a lot of uh, you know just just working with stuff and what the yeah. release point means is that that little window between not quite done and I can't recognize it anymore right. when it will actually release from that pan. And that's the same with stainless steel, that's the same with enamel, any of that kind of stuff. The, 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 the bottom line is there's a thought process, Adam. Anytime there's a thought process, you've yeah. I've pretty much clued out. Okay? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a big fan you of the thought process. You know me so well, Ma. <laughs> <laughs> so listen, with this cookware, there's no thought process. You wanna add butter, add it. You don't, don't. You wanna add oil, add it. You wanna spray it with something, go ahead. But you don't have to, and that's the whole point, you guys. And the fact that it cleans out, so simple, for being cast iron is just, uh, I don't know. I mean, it's one of those, <laughs> it's hard to describe because it still sounds weird coming out of your mouth. But all you gotta do is read the reviews. That's all you gotta do is have a look at how much people are loving them. You see, it's almost like we're saying, you know, look outside, the sky is green <laughs> instead of it being blue. Because we're so, we know it's blue, it is blue, it's gotta be blue. When you say cast iron, we know it heats up like no other. We know oh, it retains the I'll heat like the no other. We know yeah. it can brown like no other. We know it's the best and like no other. But when you say that it's really nonstick, so I don't need to use all the fats, butters, and oils, when you say that it's dishwasher safe, you're telling me the sky is a different color. But folks, it is. It's a new day. It's a world launch yep. and it's exclusive. We invite you to shop and try for it. You've got a 30-day return policy. We think you're going to love it. Oh, my gosh, okay. Mark. Adam, this is the part that I want everybody to really watch close. Okay. And this is the part that if anybody works with cast iron, this is what they're going to start to understand, okay? I just put wine in a hot cast iron pan. If you are somebody that loves your cast iron and you spend all kinds of time seasoning and babying it, you just looked at this and went <laughs> Because what wine does, or anything acidic, wine, lemon, juices, anything like that, is it literally rips, actually rips the seasoning from your pan, all right? And that's not what you want. You want that seasoning to stay on there. Well, you gotta remember, when you don't have to season it, there's nothing to rip away from it. So even if you are making a little wine reduction with some fresh cranberries oh, for the pork medallions goodness. that you just made, you don't have to worry about anything in your pan, watch this, you guys, not coming clean, because this 
is what it's all about. I'm just going to give you a nice live before and after. I don't have to re-season that. I don't have to put oil on it, put it back in the oven. That's the act of seasoning, by the way. Cooking dinner, yeah. then cooking your pan. Right, 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 right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> None of it makes any sense, if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> well, also, Mark, you know, notice an observation here. We're working on different cooktops. Absolutely. Even induction. This is safe on all of that, right? A gas, glass, uh, induction or electric. It's safe on all of it, absolutely. So I'm gonna get some chicken going for my fajita. I've got some beef going for the stew that we're actually gonna do in the next round because stew, as you know, takes a little bit of time. So sure. I got a few things to go on over yeah. here. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna okay. get a couple, a couple of things started so we can get everything in by the end of the show, okay? okay. So here's what I want you to see uh, for, for, you know, talking about nonstick. And we always talk about things like, uh, you, you know, the worst enemies of your cast iron. Well, sugar and milk solids are definitely one of the so I've got some sugar in there. I've got my stew going. Okay. I'm going to pop over to the other side here and remind you that because of the high sidewalls, yeah. because it carries the heat with it so well, it's ideal for frying. Okay. okay. So you can go ahead and you can put almost three quarters of a gallon of oil in this pot without it coming anywhere near the top. That means that now you've gone from frying to cooking in a Dutch oven, yep. to searing, yep. to, uh, what do we do, grilling, yep. and now we're frying. And I gotta tell you something, if it was just the casserole pan or just the lid by itself, you start comparing it to these fancy French names that are out there that you still have to season, you still have to baby. Personally, I can't understand the difference between, where the, I don't know, I get, it's not the place to talk about it. <laughs> well, we're here to show off tonight and to prove to you there's a better way. It was funny, one of the things I did beforehand was look up the original launch when Mark was here in January with the fry pan version. There are now over 300 reviews. Love it. 4.4 stars, everybody saying it's Love a revolution, it. it's a revelation, it's an amazing, amazing, amazing uh, new technology. If you can, you gotta get it. Real cast iron. I, it's okay. important to me that you walk away tonight understanding that. This is real cast iron. The difference is that in 2019, we've been able to reinvent the wheel. We've made real cast iron really nonstick, <laughs> and we've been able to make it really dishwasher safe. Oven safe up to 500 degrees, and that's why Mark has been able to do all of this. Real fast over here a sec. Absolutely. You get this two in one. So remember, the four quart casserole pan, and we're gonna make everything in here, obviously, as we're doing tonight, soups and stews and casseroles, you name it. But what Mark's been able to do, the pork medallions and the steaks, we take the lid, and that lid sits on there safely and securely. Purely, I take the lid, I flip it over, and there is your grill pan, you see? Both have the helper handles. Both are, you know, one single piece, so there's no riveting, everything's gonna stay solid and safe. I mean, it really is amazing. I'll show you the reverse side as well, the bottom side. That's the red, obviously, that I'm showcasing here. That's your teal, silver, blue, Row, okay, this is good. These three that you see here will be gone by the early hours of the morning. Rose, plum, and taupe. Rose, plum, and taupe. If you bought the fry pans earlier this year, you want to get the matching colors. Absolutely. And of course, a reminder on that great cookbook that we've got, the great Southern cookbook, which is going to inspire the things that you can do with your new cast iron. All right, Mark, I'm going to go All over right. to you. You've got seven minutes, my friend. Come on next? over. we got our fajitas going here. Our stew meat is just finishing. I'm going to take that down here. Our sugar is melting enough, Adam. Now, I'm not sure if you've seen me do this demonstration before, but I do Show want me. you to watch this. I've got our sugar in there and it's starting to melt. Okay, mm -hmm. so now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add cream. And this is another one of those things where you want to talk about the enemy of cast iron, milk, solids, and sugars is right up there. <laughs> so here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to let this sit there, believe it or not. Wow. Because <laughs> that's, I'll tell you something, almost any other pan, that's a bad idea. Now we've got I our stew you going. <laughs> we've got our stew going, which is terrific. All right. And now the stews are stews are stews. Yeah. I'm not really, uh, you, you know, the, the pan is the pan for the stew, but this yeah. is what I want you to see. This is what makes the stew special. Go on. And it's not like you have to buy something extra. You're getting everything you need to do this. Oh. So when you want to talk about the reason people have uh, cooking equipment like this, it's to do dishes like this, Adam, all oh day long. Gosh. Fresh bread in a Dutch oven is out of this world. And unless you've got that even heating of the sidewalls going up the side, it's never going to happen. So when you want to make 
those special dishes, when you want to stop the show, when you want people to go, good Lord, you have to eat at Adam's house, this <laughs> is the way to do it. Oh. So go ahead, have some fun with what you're cooking. Yeah. Be imaginative. Let your, uh, just like you said, let your imagination fly because you're able to, well, we're going to spend the rest of the year spooning that out. <laughs> <laughs> so go ahead and just have a good time oh. with your food, you guys, and get inventive, get imaginative, and just have fun. Okay, be honest, who at home is jealous right now? <laughs> who at home wishes it wasn't 12.30 at night and you could just jump up and quickly make that? I'm going to be trying that, and I'll take a bite for everybody watching. Five minutes left. By the way, at the end of this hour and at the end of next hour, we have a birthday surprise. So at the end of this hour and at the end of next hour, two birthday surprises you will not want to mix. Look at this, uh, look at this, look at this. All Mark, right, come on us. in here, you guys. This is what it is. If you can make caramel in a cast iron pan, boy, you got something going. So let me go ahead and just give this a dump. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Got my little more cream. I just want to dig in, there we go. What's that? Yeah. You're Do digging you in? Thank you. <laughs> Let's go Jeez. ahead and put this over the ice cream. There we are. I love it, you guys. Fresh you caramel in a cast it, iron pan. And here's uh, what I want you to see. Come on inside here. It's not about the caramel. You, it's not about the ice so cream. Nice. Watch this. Thank you. It's about that cleanup. Yeah. It's about being able to take it right off the bottom of that pan, you guys. And by the way, if the wipeout is too much work for you, yeah. put it in the dishwasher. <laughs> because you can. <laughs> it really because is that you simple. Can. You can go ahead and put that in the dishwasher. Guys, the possibilities are endless. What you can do uh, with this recipe-wise virtually never ends. And what I want you to do is try some of the favorite meals that you have that you've made in this, you know, non-stick cookware that you have. Yeah. And go ahead and cook it in this. Try it in this. Give it a go in this. And you're going to find that no matter what kind of cookware you have, yeah. no matter what you've been using, when you have the chance and the opportunity to go ahead and switch to cast iron yeah. without any of the work, holy moly. So I got a couple of other treats in the oven there. I got to grab one of them to show you. That uh, Dutch and baby. And that Dutch baby, the Dutch we, put baby. In there. we need the reel of, the, reel of the Dutch baby. So here's how you serve this, Adam. And Rose now the most limited. Here we go. So all you're going to do is right in the pot, okay. and that's the cool thing. With either the, uh, the the lid or the pan, you can serve these right at the table. So right in the pot, all you're going to do is give that a shot with some berries, a little bit of icing sugar, and maybe some whipped cream if you've got it. Oh and there gosh. is the coolest cast iron casserole dessert that you've ever had, you guys. Have a look at that. It's fast, it's easy, and the results are completely out of this world because of the tools that you're using, Adam. Okay, you guys need to be censored. Between the two of you, Kat and Mark, this is, this is a <laughs> remarkable presentation. Isn't that fun? This is a quick overview of the features. Four quart, real non-stick coating. Real non-stick coating with this amazing exterior. Real cast iron. You get the lid that doubles up as a lid, and of course, you can flip that over and use that as a grill by itself. Oven safe up to 500 degrees. Put it in the dishwasher, it's okay. This isn't grandma's cast iron. <laughs> this isn't cast iron that you need to baby. This isn't cast iron that you need to dry, otherwise it will rust. This isn't cast iron that you need to season. This isn't cast iron with all the things that hold you back. It's cast iron with all the benefits. Exactly. You know, with all the beautiful even heating and the best thing for browning, but with none of the bad stuff. All the good, none of the bad. Exactly. So we've got our fried uh, broccoli cheddar balls out there. Let's go ahead and take the lid off. We're ready for this. I love this. The big we've reveal. spent the last few months oh! traveling the country, Adam. I told you about that. We yeah. have been all over the place, Mark's man. on the grill. Mark's on the grill. We had ribs in Memphis. We had all kinds of just incredible food. And one of the, our first stop was New Orleans. And let me tell you something, the jambalaya there, out of this world. So I'm gonna go ahead. The best. And I'm gonna do this one, there we go. And one of these, and we're gonna do it the right way. <laughs> Guys, get this pan home, try some of these dishes, get inventive with what you're doing, have a great time with it. Because yeah. at the end of the day, it's all about serving oh my these gosh. incredible, have a look there. Have a look at that, the, the inside of that pan, you guys. This is what I wanted to show you. There's nothing to clean. No, there's, there's nothing. nothing there. <laughs> if you've used cast iron before, you're looking at this going, that's not right. It doesn't make sense. But look at this, crispy rice on the outside. Oh, Adam, dig in. I'm digging Please. in. Please, I'm digging that in. char on the rice makes a dish. And if you don't have that heavy cast iron, that heavy metal, you lose this. Oh, you wow. lose that dimension of flavor. Because what ends up happening with that cookware that we've used in the past, like I said, it's like a sheet of glass. So come on over here, Adam. Mm -hmm. A dish like this is yeah. almost impossible. Look what we've done. 
So you're gonna take a couple of cans of your favorite cream soup. Yep. That's it, and then you're gonna take one of those cans of biscuits. Okay. And you're just gonna line them up on top. Yeah. And you have a 15 minute chicken pot pie oh, with my. fresh biscuits I need that your family's gonna go crazy over. And I gotta tell you something, not only is it even and beautiful and yummy, but that pot and that pan simply go through the dishwasher to finish up. So whether it's steaks, burgers, jambalayas, frying, whether you're doing sliders, caramel for your ice cream, making fresh salsa, maybe you're doing nachos, which is what we'll end this with as we go out, because you gotta see this, all right? It's absolutely, you got the nachos? We gotta see the nachos. All right, right there. Guys, guys. Here we go. <laughs> can, 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 can we just give a round of applause, right. please, Watch for Kat and for Mark and the entire culinary team? Oh, look at There's that. There's your nachos. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Unbelievable. Every single thing you could imagine, Mark and the team have been able to do. Thank you for your orders and your calls. I hope you get it. It is a world first cast iron like you've never seen before. Virtually everybody is picking up our Southern Cast Iron Cookbook, which is gonna give you some inspiration like Mark has given us today. Look at that. He's as proud as anything of that little work of art right there. Look, get the ooey gooey. Look at this, the final shot. Ooey gooey cheese. I wish we could come round to your house right now and let you share and dig into that. Cookbook is available, $17.95 with five flexible payments. Um, definitely get that while you can. I also want to tell you that we're doing some specials tonight, including a birthday surprise at the end of this hour and a birthday surprise at the end of the next hour. Mark will return after he's had a little snack. So a big snacky poo time. A big snack. <laughs> Just before we go to a, a quick momentary pause, I want to tell you we have a special deal on our spice mill. Two chambers in one. Stainless steel, you can change the grind, and with this, you press it, and it's going to do it automatically for you. But one particular body that's split into two down there makes a lot more sense than two. Lowest price ever, $19.95. Add that to your order, makes a great gift for somebody or a housewarming present. Anna Griffin, acclaimed designer, is also back at HSN on Tuesday for a 26-hour craft event. Anna is bringing us a today's special and more of her craft collection in her signature sophisticated style. Hopefully you can tune in. Sarah Davies with Crafter's Companion is also gonna be here on the day. On the way next, for those of us that are not drinking enough water we're going to make it more flavorful than ever before with a best seller and an amazing guest to so stay with us more kitchen hq after this Let's do it. Okay. I believe in being full of confidence and free of doubt. I believe what I'm doing is bigger than me. I choose to face the world full of love and free of hate. Free of hate. Cut it out. I make clean choices and I believe in clean beauty. I believe in knowing that what I'm using is good for me. Full of care and free of cruelty. Full of what's good. Free of what's fake. Bare Minerals, the power of good. Bare Minerals on HSN. Celebrate HSN's birthday with an HSN card. Apply now and instantly get $25 off when you're approved. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of birthday perks, like two extra flex every Wednesday in July, plus VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, and there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. It's Juliana Rand here and I just want to say happy 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 birthday HSN Mwah! to many more
The amazing Chris Kohartz, who has the answer to a problem that, quite honestly, a lot of us have. Water can be so boring, Chris. So boring. It's just so, so plain. bland, and we need to drink more water. How do we make water more flavorful? Because when water's not flavorful, we turn to sodas. We turn to the sugary drinks. We turn to the sweet drinks. The way we do it tonight with our proprietary Kitchen HQ is with our amazing Triton pitcher. This is your infusing pitcher. Chris, everybody loves this. <laughs> this item. You take your they favorite things do. and you put them in it. You absolutely do. So you take your favorite beverages, your waters, your wines, your teas, your coffees, and you flavor it with real ingredients, real fruits, real vegetables that you know are truly what they are, what they right, say they are. Right. So this is this is one of those pitchers that we've thought of everything possible when it comes to a pitcher. So let's just talk about the pitcher. First of all, it's a three quart capacity pitcher, yep. which means you're going to have a lot of beverage in here. Okay. Right. It's made from Triton. Okay. Now what's Triton? The good stuff. It's the, <laughs> it's the amazing non. You can't break it. It's shatter resistant. Yeah. This is the stuff that they use to make out of airplane windows. Oh my god. So this is like a really durable pitcher, right, right? Made to last. Then you get the infusion chamber. This is where you place all of your fresh berries, or if you think about vegetables like cucumbers oh. would be really nice in water, but this is how you flavor your waters, any beverage, and you'll steep it in here just like this. And what's so great about the infusion chamber is it locks into place, yep. and the longer you let your fruits, your vegetables steep inside your beverage, yeah. the more flavorful it becomes. How long could you think, would it stay good for would you say as long as you leave it completely submerged in the liquid yeah. you can keep this for two weeks oh. so every time you pour it out just add more liquid and you'll you could be good to go so yes you could actually make this before bedtime like right now yeah. put it in the fridge and you'll have a wonderful refreshing treat all day long if you're trying to lose weight and you know you've got to cut back on the sodas the sugary drinks this is your new best friend a lot of the water enhancers you're the right. water flavorings that you buy it's full of very many ingredients half of which we cannot read True. this is all real it's all natural it's all good for you we have three different colors we have red we have teal and blue this is a quick presentation after this is our birthday surprise and then we have one in the next hour uh, You've gone healthy down. I love the berries. This, you can do everything. You can do everything now I want to show you that you come with this it comes with a screw top lid Which is so important because if you want to take this picture to the beach yeah. to the lake you can and right. it's not going to spill if you want to put it on its side in the refrigerator to save space it's leak proof, right? And when you take it out, if you still want it to be cold, again, we've thought of everything. It comes with an ice puck. Oh and gosh. this actually you can keep in the freezer. It's so small. Right. But when you're ready to put it on the table, you just put it into the base here. Right. And you put it right underneath the Get pitcher away. just like that. And it keeps it nice and cold. Now, we're not going to stop there. We've also included a steeper. Okay. So if you want to make iced tea, if you want to make iced coffee, you can with this amazing pitcher. And yes, you can infuse the flavors there too. So let's get some fun. Let's have some fun with this. All right. It is summertime. Yep. That means it's sangria <gasps> time, right? Oh, yes. So this is a white wine sangria. And look what I've put in here. I've put in here both fresh and frozen fruit. But when you cut the fruit, it releases all of its flavors into the wine. And sangria is just that wonderful fortified wine from Spain. Oh, I but love what this. about a fruity, refreshing cocktail for, let's say, after work? Uh, with dinner. I mean, Adam, you, you need to partake in some of this. You, you'll be the envy of your friends. People <laughs> come over. You, you know, you're having a get together, some sangria. You, you serve it like this. It'll be so impressive. By the way, free shipping and handling and five flex pay, which is just nuts. And if you use the HSN credit card, you, you get an eight extra flex on that. If you don't have it, apply for one. You can take $25 your first single item purchase. Let me just try. Hold on a second. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Because that, so what Adam's drinking again, it's a white one sangria. It's just a fortified white wine that I've added some fruits to. It's Don't really refreshing. Do. Now, if you like that, mm. I have got to show you this because okay. again, it's summertime. 
How about margaritas, oh. all right? What if we took our favorite margarita mix and infused it with more limes, more lemons, and in this case, I put some jalapeno in oh, here. Oh, look at you. Right? You're because dangerous. Because Mexican <laughs> food, I mean, you need a little bit of spice to enjoy Mexican food, but if you're going to have a cocktail, or if you're gonna serve cocktails at home, why not enhance it with a little bit of flavor and flavors that you know are fresh, from your favorite grocer, from your favorite farmer's market, but it's also a beautiful presentation. I mean, this is how you drink margaritas, Adam. Chris, you don't know this because you're busy working along here making some wonderful drinks, but we are very, very busy. <laughs> um, if you would like to order, you must order now, especially in the red or that beautiful blue. We're saying three minutes um, before we go to our birthday surprise. We also have the teal. I'll just quickly try this. Okay, Cheers. well now, while Adam's drinking his two cocktails, I'm gonna talk a little bit about detox water because mm. this is what they serve at the spa, yes. right? When you go to a fancy spa, they'll give you cucumbers. Makes you feel and healthy. And lemon, and in this one I put ginger. And this is something that I keep in my refrigerator all the time because it's just so healthy for mm. you. And it's a great way to drink water. So this is, again, cucumbers and ginger and mint and lemon and again I like to make it the night before and I just let it steep in my refrigerator overnight and then all day long I'm sipping this beautiful wonderful just enhanced water and it's just such a refreshing way to enjoy a beverage can I can I tell you an old joke aside and this is re <laughs> really the case I I have always loved fruit infused waters yes. and it was one time that we went to a hotel and they had it and I was like why don't we do this at home and we tried other pitchers but they just weren't good they let you know some of the the seeds or stuff through you had to drain it it was a oh. mess this gives you all of what you want with none of the heartache or hassle it's designed to fit in your refrigerator I want to urge you if you're not drinking enough water you're not hydrated if you like me are and were addicted to the sugary drinks and the sodas, it's because water is so plain. It's, it's true. It's so boring. It is so true. You, and don't, you can jazz it up with you this. You can totally jazz it up. And what I love about this pitcher is it goes both hot and cold. Yes. It's great for seltzer water. So yes, if you have one of those soda makers at home, you could do bubbling things on Fabulous. it. If you enjoy iced tea or iced coffee, look, this is iced coffee right here. I have got vanilla beans all the way in here in this coffee Spoiling but you me. could also put cinnamon in here mm. right I'm gonna put a wonderful Gorgeous. alcoholic cream in here <laughs> <laughs> so that we have a beautiful iced coffee but look at this this is really just a wonderful way to do you'll coffee. have me on the floor Chris in a second <laughs> what are you doing to me tonight My and gosh. I have to show you this too because it's summertime it is iced tea season so with the steeper all you're going to do is you're going to fill it up with your loose teas or your loose coffee and I'm going to actually pull it out so you can see that here but yes you can steep hot or cold beverages in here you lock it into place yeah. you just steep it a couple of times yeah. and then after you make your tea guess what I'm going to put in here you've got it thank you Adam my peaches <gasps> how about a beautiful peach iced tea. I'm going to lock the infuser into place and now, now everyone's going to have a beautiful, wonderful summer. You'll use this every single day and every single week. And whether it's for the fun drinks, the adult drinks, the soothing drinks, the relaxing drinks, the detox drinks, the healthy drinks, the water fruit infused drinks, it will become your new best friend. I encourage you to shop for it. Teal, red or blue. It's a fabulous product with free shipping and handling. Chris Kahart, so thank you so thank much. Thank you, Adam. What a pleasure to be with you. It it's always good to see oh, you. Oh my goodness. And I, to give you drinks. I, to give me drinks. <laughs> I, met, I met Chris 12 years ago when we first started on HSM. One of the it's most true. wonderful ages you'll ever meet. I love you. Thank you, my darling. Thank you so love much. Me too. I want to tell you, I mentioned we have two surprises. One at the end of this hour and one at the end of the next hour. The one at the end of next hour is this. Everybody's talking about hydrogen infused water. Why? People are excited about the benefits to skin, to energy, uh, benefits against the aging process. It's back, it's finally back. It sold out with Colleen about two months ago. I think the 750, we have five flex pay, lowest price, there's blue or red. We'll show you how it works. We will enrich 
regular water with hydrogen in three minutes or less. People are spending 50 bucks on getting bottles of hydrogen water, I'm telling you. In fact, you know what, if you Google hydrogen water, put benefits of hydrogen water, you're gonna be knocked out of, uh, uh, you'll knock your socks off rather. Um, you can pre-order it right now, but let's roll along. Let's reveal our first birthday surprise of the hour. Is it an air fryer? Is it a toaster oven? Is it a rotisserie? Is it a convection oven? Is it a dehydrator? Can you bake? Can you broil? Can you grill? You can do it all. Our birthday surprise price of $129.95, six flex pay, which is our most generous flex, and free shipping and handling. This is our unique exclusive Kitchen HQ. Do it all, 10 quart air fryer with rotisserie. Folks, I've long been an advocate for air frying because you cut down on the oil, you cut down on the fat, you cut down on the calories, you still get the crisp, the crunch, the taste. This is not just an air fryer, it's everything you ever wanted. Talking of which, our special guest is also everything we ever wanted, Mr. John Florell <laughs> returns. How are you, sir? I'm good, I'm good. Good to see you. John, air fryers have become the most popular segment of kitchen appliances over the past five years. This takes that to a whole new level. I know, it really does. Well, air frying came around because uh, it, it's a healthier way right. to fry food. And what most people think of as fried food is soaking in oil. Yes. Well, if you're not familiar with air fryers, which I don't know who isn't at this point, this air fryer is more than just an air fryer. We have an air fryer. You can see it's a rotisserie. It's an oven. You can bake in this. You can air fry. You can use it as a toaster oven if you like. It'll even dehydrate all in one machine, and it's no bigger than really a toaster oven that sits on your countertop in the kitchen. And, and it's handsome, it looks good. <laughs> right, and it's so easy to use because everything is all inclusive. Everything is right here. Uh, I'm just gonna open this up because I've got these uh, chicken wings going in here. We've been air frying chicken wings, oh boy. okay? Uh, and just to show you real quick, I'm, I, by the way, it comes with all the tools you'll need to uh, to use the machine. Uh, this air fryer, uh, this little uh, rotisserie basket is amazing. Uh, this is one of the best things. Now, it does come with trays, too. You okay. can use the trays if you like. Do I get everything I've, that you're showing me tonight? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yes, okay. it all comes with it. And I'm just going to kind of take this off. You can use oven mitts at home. Uh, I usually have an oven glove out here, but I'm just going to pop the lid off of this to show you guys at home how quick and easy air frying chicken wings can be <laughs> and the crispy, crunchy texture that you get with air frying, it doesn't take away by not having the oil. Right. The right. only thing it takes away is the saturated fats it's of the oil. It's a healthier way yes. to do it all round. A absolutely. And I, I, again, there's uh, no difference in taste, texture. You get that crispy, crunchy uh, texture to these. And again, it's done uh -huh. literally in seconds. Now, if you've ever tried to do things in an oven, yeah. okay, even things like, but maybe it's frozen french fries, Right. if you think about that. Or maybe you wanna do some uh, some tater tots or something like that that comes out of the oven frozen, yes. okay? And these are frozen. I like, can feel it on the bottom <laughs> of my hand here. Okay, you normally have to take the time to heat up, preheat your oven, yeah. okay? Then you take out a big old, uh, look at this, this comes with two different trays. Which is fabulous. And I'm using both of them. It actually comes with three, but I'm, I'll show you that uh, the, the next one here in a second. Okay. I'm gonna close the lid, Watch what happens here when I close the door. You'll see everything come to life right here in the front, okay? So if I wanted to air fry, you can hit maybe the chicken. That's why this one's blinking. Yeah. Or pork chops, or if you wanted to do uh, pork tenders, or if you want to do shrimp, fish, you can bake in it. You can dehydrate. Uh, this is for your vegetables. Here's for your frozen, like French fries, sure. tater tots, or we put in the, uh, uh, the cheese sticks in here. All you do is push the button, it automatically automatically turns on, it will set, it'll set the temperature and the time perfectly for your french fries. Okay, I'm gonna turn the light off now. So you'll see, when this comes on, it automatically starts. You don't do anything. It sets the perfect temperature and the time. And the best part about this with Kitchen HQ, yeah. you can adjust this. If you want a little bit, another minute or two, you can go do another minute or two. If you need a temperature change, if you think 400 degrees maybe might not be enough, or maybe it's taking a little bit too long because you can watch your food, yeah. you can actually adjust the temperature. Down, it goes up to 400, all the way down to 70 degrees for, uh, for dehydrating. The functionality is brilliant. 
I mean, just by saying dehydrator, right. as well as being your air fryer, your rotisserie, to be your toaster oven, yeah. to be your and convection oven. And what it does, oven. it takes that supercharged heated air and forces it down around the food for your air frying. Right. Here's the rotisserie for a chicken or for Cornish hens. Here's your rotisserie basket. You can do, you, we have a kebab rack that comes with this. So it comes included today for your pizzas, whether they be frozen pizzas or homemade pizzas. You're gonna love that there's every setting that you would imagine you can roast, bake, grill, air fry, and dehydrate all in one machine. This is a new type of appliance that's got all the benefits of air frying, but now adding on so much. If we were to break down the cost, and we said we wanted to buy a toaster oven, we wanted to buy an air fryer, well, right. we're already at a couple hundred dollars right there. Right. We want to buy a dehydrator. We want to buy your convection oven. I mean, convection technology is some of the most expensive technology when it comes to kitchens. This has it built in, let alone the fact, John, Crispy, that it's going to save crunchy. us money not heating up the big oven. I, that's exactly right, it, and it sits right on your countertop so you can do everything from toast in the morning right. or a bagel to doing your crispy crunch look at that here's a whole basket full of crispy crunchy french fries mm. done literally in a few minutes without preheating the oven without heating up the house and without spending the kind of money it takes to listen how big is your oven right. they're made for like what <laughs> thanksgiving exactly. christmas those big turkeys those big meals if you have 15 people over that's when you're going to use your big oven right for something like if it's one or two people Every three people, day. four people, you'll use this every single day, and it sits out right on your countertop. Incidentally, this is the gray. John was previously demonstrating on the red, and we have a black available as well. Perfect size. In terms of the size, it's just a little bit taller than a toaster oven. Yeah. So for most countertops, it's going to be fine. It's 14 and 3 eighths of an inch in height, 13 inches in the width, and 12 and a quarter in the length. It's, 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 it's a sweet spot size, and it is important to know that when John said you could do your kebabs, in this he's right when he says you get your two layers uh, layers of trays he's also absolutely telling you as it is so he's doing both the cheese sticks he's doing the tater tots in there you're going to get everything to do the rotisserie it all comes included with a great easy start recipe booklet and an easy guide to walk you through all the options including how to do the dehydrate as well free shipping six flex it's our first birthday surprise our next birthday surprise is at the end of next hour. It's that hydrogen enriched water maker, which we're excited about as well. I think for many of us, John, we're looking at ways to make life easier in the kitchen. Right. You get home from work or the kids are hungry. They're getting hangry, as they say. This gives you great <laughs> food, healthier food, really yes. fast. And, and it's done literally with the touch of a button. Right. That's what I love about it. It's all inclusive. By the way, it comes with recipes, okay? A lot of these recipes, this is one of them right here. Uh, this is a pork tenderloin mm -hmm. and I'll tell you what here I'm just gonna grab one of these cloths because Please. this just came out of there I'll tell you what if you love pork tenderloin we've done this bacon wrapped okay you can try this at home use your recipes it does come with recipes with the machine however mm -hmm. so if you want to try some of the recipes we give you with the machine they're delicious they're healthy because again without grease without oil you're air frying your food, and this look is, at uh, look at that, baked pork tenderloin. It comes job. out absolutely perfect. Not dry. <laughs> There's, yeah, if you, listen, if you've never tried an air fryer, or if you, well, if you, wait, wait until you try the pork tenderloin out yeah, of this machine. Yeah, if you're you. tired of, of dry pork, yeah. <laughs> this will take care of it. Okay, so we're, we're excited you're loving it. Black is the most limited at this stage. Amongst the gray, we also have the red available. Everything comes with 30, days return policy. Whenever you introduce a new way to cook in the kitchen, it's kind of a leap of faith because we're not used to maybe using this. If you were considering buying an air fryer, even air fryers are now evolving. So this is the next generation of air fryer that quite frankly, John, to your point, is yes. doing more than it's ever done before. Well, you can bake, you can broil, you can uh, literally do everything you can do in your conventional oven, but it's also a convection oven. It's a dehydrator. It has the rotisserie. It has the rotisserie basket. You can all, you can do a four a four and a half pound chicken in your air fryer, okay? And here, let me turn the light on. I don't know if you guys can see. 
it's got a light button right here, so you can literally see the food oh, as it's good. cooking. Okay, now that's set up on the rotisserie spit. Yeah. It also comes with those kebabs. So the kebab sticks sure. that work with that rotisserie spit. Yeah. And I gotta show you this. And, and I, while this is going here, in fact, let me do this real quick. I'm gonna throw some quesadillas in. Okay. Okay, because listen, these are quick, they're easy snacks that the kids can make at home. Instead of, you know, instead of having, having to cook this or, or heat up a, a stove top, yeah. now you can do this right in your, roti or in your uh, uh, air fryer. I've got some, uh, 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 cheese sandwiches okay, yeah so yeah melted beautiful cheese. and we're gonna, all you do is push a button now this is the power button right here Turn so simple on. to use i'm going to put this on uh let's see i'm going to put this on reheat okay so if you want to reheat a piece of pizza all you do is push this button 300 degrees 12 minutes it, it takes care of it for you if you only want it for 10 minutes you can turn that down to 10 minutes or you can do it to nine minutes whatever the case is you can adjust the temperature when you see the temperature come up on here uh -huh. 300 if you want to go to 325 i can set that to 325 so it's completely customizable as well as the presets that come with it so all you do is push the button everything starts automatically it's so simple to use the select button takes care of it and let's run over here because Please, i gotta show you. you this rack after you and everything that comes with the machine today is is it, it, everything is included so these racks right here okay this is the base rack and the, the, these are the three trays right now this one Okay, is actually two. They stack together beautifully for storage. Okay, these are your uh, your air frying trays. I love them for. Well, you can also do your uh, dehydrating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one I love to keep on the bottom of the machine, okay. especially when you're doing like a rotisserie chicken. It catches all the oh, the grease sure, that comes off sure. the chicken. But you can also use this as a roasting pan. Okay. Inside the machine, it also comes with a diffuser. This goes up on top for when you're doing your dehydrating. And remember, it goes all the way down to 70 degrees degrees for dehydrating. Okay. okay. So you can literally dehydrate in this machine. It comes with a rotisserie basket. Okay. okay? That's the one that we had the uh, the chicken wings in. Yeah. It comes with a little tool to, uh, to put the basket in and out with. And this is one of the coolest things I think they came up with. It's a stand that holds everything together. So Brilliant. you want to load up your, your kebabs, you can load up beef, chicken, pork, whatever, sure, just sure, kebabs sure. or veggie kebabs like we have here. But this holds it for you. If you want to do the, the, the basket as well, it holds the basket up so you can load and unload the basket. Right. It's so great. And then it comes with the book that shows you everything in, uh, about the machine and all these recipes are, are tried and tested recipes. They're delicious, they're healthy, good for you, and they're, they're designed to use with this machine. <laughs> it, is, it is a appliance like no other air fryer that we've featured on HSN. It boils down to the rapid hot air technology, family size 10 quart capacity, yet does not take up a lot of space in terms of the footprint. You get the rotisserie spit, so now you don't have to buy the rotisserie chickens from the uh, grocery store. You're gonna get the skewer rack, be able to do your kebabs that we showed. I love the air racks that you get. Many of us with traditional air fryers, we tend to have to kind of shuffle the basket around right. so that it gets even yes, across this, everything. That's that's what I love about the rotisserie basket. Right. You never have to shuffle the food. Right, it does not with it for this. You. And look at this, we did two racks of pretzels, okay? If you love pretzels, a little bit of beer cheese or maybe oh. some uh, uh, ketchup or mustard, you can serve that. There's two racks, okay, of pretzels, perfect for a little entree for the, or a little uh, hors d'oeuvre for, uh, for the company that shows up. Oh my gosh. I'll tell you what, they're delicious, yeah. Mm, <laughs> and and they're air fried mm. in the, in, in the uh, HQ air fryer. I mean, it's more than just an air fryer, that's the thing. I've seen air fryers that go for well over $100. Every day. I've seen dehydrators that sell for well over $100. This is, a, it dehydrates, it's a fryer, it's a baker, it broils, it does everything you would do in your conventional oven at yeah. home, and much, much more. <laughs> okay, so we, we only have two minutes left. The, did you just say the black or the red is now the most limited, Steve? Red, red is the most limited now. Now what about healthy stuff like salmon? Oh, you yeah. can do it. Oh, you, you can do literally anything you can do in your oven and more. The salmon comes out delicious, it's beautiful. In fact, here, let me. I'm gonna dish this up, I'm gonna plate Cut this up here that. in the front because I tell you what, you, you wanna talk about delicious salmon, this pulls apart, it looks just like, I mean, that Ooh. is just amazing. It's juicy, it's delicious, healthy. healthy. And here, let me get that over to this one because I know we only have a couple minutes left here. But this, if you use it for this alone, just for pizzas, uh, again, it's a nine inch by nine inch. And by the way, I should mention too, 
if you want to use your own pans in here, yeah. if you have a round or a, rect or a rectangle or square pan, a nine inch by nine inch fits perfectly in well, there, round or rectangle. Know, sure. So you can use your own cookware in here as well. Wonderful. But look at this. I mean, crispy, crunchy, even done on the bottom. Just as I like it. <laughs> it's done perfect. Uh, here, let me, it's kind of hot, just came out. But I'll tell you what, let me cut this up because just for pizzas, yeah. it's worth it. I mean, listen. Can you hear that crunch? I, I, of course <laughs> I did, yeah. You know, it's better food, it's faster food, it's healthier food. You don't sacrifice on any flavor. Whether you're using it every day for the kids' chicken nuggets, wonderful. Whether you're using it to cook a healthy, fast salmon asparagus dinner, it's amazing. Treats, whether you are doing breakfast, lunch, or dinner, it is everything. Your toaster oven. You want to do a bagel in here? You can do it. You want a rotisserie of chicken? You can do it. You want kebabs? You can do it. It becomes your everything. You'll use this more than your traditional oven. There's no doubt oh, about yeah, it. Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, even <laughs> look at the twice-baked potatoes. <laughs> I mean, um, delicious. They're healthy. They're good for you. Like I said, it's a, it's, a, it's a broiler as well as an air fryer, an oven. I mean, you can literally bake cakes in this. In fact, You'll notice when I push this button here, you can see the cake, but the cupcake button. I see. That's it. your bake button. So when you press that, depending on where in the country you are, it'll automatically set it for 330 degrees. If you live in a higher altitude, you can adjust that. You can adjust the time for different altitudes. Like if you live in Colorado, sure. things don't bake the same as they do here right, in Florida. Right, right. So you can totally customize it. I love the fact that it's as customizable or as automatic as you want it to be. John, thank you so much, oh, thank my you. friend. What a wonderful buffet you've put on for everybody tonight. <laughs> thank you for all of your orders in black, red, or the gray, the unique and exclusive exclusive Kitchen HQ 10 quart air fryer oven with the bonus rotisserie. Remember, everything that John's used, all the accessories are included tonight at no extra cost with six flex pay and of course, the amazing free shipping.